Uh, Rami says, is there, there is still hope, right? Absolutely, there's still hope. Come on now. The fact that you can get up and try to make light of the situation, right? You can say, hey, listen, I'm not broken. I'm not alone. I'm still doing my thing. You're not going to stop me from going out and enjoying my life. Uh, ultimately, you know, these kind of folks want you to get deterred by the idea that you may never work again, right? I'm not deterred by that because I barely work as it is, right? I work every couple of years. That's cool. I'm fine with that. But I'm going to make sure that they're projects that I, that I feel really passionate about. And, you know, people say, well, what about protecting the bag? And it's like, I'm not, I'm not concerned about protecting the bag. I'm actually concerned about making sure that the bag that I'm getting is as ethical as I can get it, right? Like, I care about the people I work with more than I care about the bag. So uh, that's nothing new to me. I don't care about being uh, what people would consider to be broke because I've, I've been there before, right? At the end of the day, as crazy as this world is right now, I think the last thing that I'm concerned about is trying to stockpile money and this and that. I'm, I'm more concerned about uh, how short uh, our, my time is going to relatively is going to be on this planet, relatively speaking. So uh, that's all there really is to it for me. I don't really have anything else I would want to.